spend the rest of the duty with me. Okay, yes, we all that, that very much. Okay, no problem. If you, if you enjoyed it, then that's not a problem. Well, I want to experience what it's like and go up from the train and what else you do and stuff. And 
get a variety of energy. Well, that's really it. There's nothing else really that happens to me. I experience it, so I've got some experience in mind. So I don't know what I do get there one day. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Do some of your class have more special needs than yourself? Yeah, yeah I'm just slow learner, but I understand picking up things. Slow communication for me. That's okay. That's all wrong with me, slow communication and, you know. You're a very clever young man, I think. You've got, you've got your head screwed on. Yeah. Hopefully, it won't hold you back. Because you could, with a little bit of training, you could easily uh, work in and around the station or hopefully one day the trains or in one of the offices but you certainly could work because TfL are, are meant to pride themselves on equal opportunities in yeah. fire. Yeah. So if they said okay you're not 100% okay to be on the train, yeah. you certainly could be on the stations, you could certainly be involved, couldn't you? Yeah, the only, the only thing I see is how it would be okay to be a train operator. You've got door interlock, so it doesn't open if you press the wrong side, it won't open. Plus, Monday to Friday, it'll be in ATO, but there'll be occasional times when it'll be in PN. Yeah, but you, that, you've got to be able to drive in PN any time. Yeah, any time. Because we had to do PN driving today. Yeah. But my brain works 50% slow, 50% got it, got it, got it, got it. So, 50-50. Today I'm being a bit, today I feel this, I'm a bit slow in the morning, so it's more I'll be fast. All that rubbish sugar, no. I haven't drunk it for five months. And we continue to do well. Because yeah, totally. I used to be. All your brain needs is lots of water. Exactly. I stopped it because it was having a bit of an impact on my chest. I didn't feel too right with my chest, so it gave me a bit of a rule. You know, that don't drink it or something. Yeah, definitely. So I stopped anyway. But before this club, before this club, before the pre previous time, I said I was going to stop. It only takes one bottle, one can. It only takes one can, I'm triggered back on it. Yeah. So. Him. He said to us that to go over, go to 
down that back the alley on the way to a death row via, you know. Yeah. So we went that way and then the guy wouldn't let us through through the gate. Because so they can't let you through. So to explain to him what, what message you're carrying. And he goes, I can't let you through because health and safety plus so and so just make an excuse to just walk, walk me off the way. Walk me fuck me if I went off. Well, when I see Barry next week, I'm going to ask him uh, does he have the coldest green man his email? What about a Morton? Uh, we've tried that, we have no response to uh, the Denver manager. There's a new one took him over there now. Barry emailed him, but he hasn't got back. And my wife's been still around in less than more than four weeks. It's not going to happen next week. I don't four see weeks. why can't somebody like me just walk you down to Golders, to, to Morden. Golders Green's a long way to go. Yeah. I would, um, I want one that's just to go in the depot and just to do a bit, bit of film on my camera, a bit of taking photos with permission from the depot manager. Yeah, I, I could, um, I could ask somebody if, if you like, I know one of the guys, he's yeah. a driver, Yeah. he's based at Morden, yeah. but he's like, he, he, he's part time, he's permanently, re yeah. when he's not driving he's released to cover the depot, basically he's the depot man, Yeah. so he moves the trains around the depot. Oh, so, oh yeah. 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 I'll ring him. I'll ask him. All I want to do is go to Depot, go when places are off juice. Or off juice or off juice because you can't take the line or something off juice places. Yeah. No, but if you um if you were with somebody and you were able, they could walk you on the on the walkways, yeah. Which is obviously designated safe areas, and you could walk and you could just observe the train to a safe area. Yeah, well, or you could walk in, in the depot. I reckon it could be easily arranged. Yeah. But all I want to do is jump, come on one of these, which I ask me to get in one of these, you know, film, film through filming. Obviously, I'm not going to upload it, but I just want to go through filming it in the depot, walk through the train when it's in the depot, filming it, go inside it. And also, I want to go right to the end, see the 1959 stop car, the old build stop back. That's what I want to do, just take a few photos and film and just go jump to the train. I asked somebody, a person would have been sent my photos while I've been here, sitting in the depot boat, you know, just a bit of it. And I asked them, asked them when you saw any old train parts, the old door buttons for these trains. We we'll collect some of them and anything, really, diagrams, anything. Well, they used to have some of the old buttons, but I bet you they'd be thrown away now. Yeah, sad. I was, I was hoping to pinch one. So it was tough, it was one. Run to the actual train. I wanted um, one of the things I wanted to get out of this way to do it. Um, a couple of weeks ago, uh, do you remember what, a couple of weeks ago, uh, one of the Fridays, we had a one under at uh, Hampstead. Yeah. You know, me and Barry, uh, we caught Whisper on the radio, we were looking at tracking it. And it was train 004. services between Mile End and the... Uh, I didn't hear about that one. Yeah, we, we, we were reviewing it on track and it. Would be right, me. So what I like to do is... Yeah, something else. 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 Yeah
on their way to the train, they yeah. told Kennington to get somebody down there, then they could have told what train number it was. Yeah. Excuse me, sir, can you just wait there and I'll, uh, there's some station staff on their way to you. Exactly. Right. To assist you, sir. as you're passing through because then she, if you don't say hi, she thinks you've been, you know, you're getting by. Because she's married to me, I've got that, I didn't know. Yeah, it's all Barry's there mostly every day, as far as I know. Okay, yeah. Do you work Fridays? Do you work yeah. during Fridays? I work every day, yeah. Until, I, until the roster says I have a Friday off. 
Anyway, the round's about, I don't know, uh, half four five because the round's on Fridays until then. He doesn't get into about quarter past like 11 15, 11 30. So. Tell Barry, yeah. if all else fails, to have a word with Morden, the, like the booking on desk, or somebody at Morden, yeah. to give the DDM, or as they call the depot manager, a call, yeah. and arrange for you, to, as, as you're in every day, to nip up there for half an hour. And it could be with one of the managers there, yeah. or it could be with a driver or an instructor operator that may be just sitting on their backside doing nothing for half an hour. Yeah. It shouldn't be an issue at all. It shouldn't be a big thing. Some, some of them might be funny about using a camera, others won't, so... Well, if they, just, say, if they say no, fair dues, fair dues. Exactly. You don't have to go into the depot, you can walk a, a safe way around and, and look, you'll be able to see enough, and then you can walk around to a place to see the, and you can go through the main entrance for that, to go and see the 59 stop or whatever it is. Yeah, no, They use it as like an old office or something. Yeah, all I want to do is go and have a jump. And get, go in there and have a look at it. Do you don't, don't see it being a problem at all. If anything, what would. Yeah. It should be the easiest thing to arrange for you, no problem. It's just. Yeah. I'll talk to them um, Friday, next Friday, and I go in.
to be the top of the station, you've got a couple, you've got the, you've got the, the blue, and white, uh, blue and white building, yeah. and you've got the railings. Um, sometimes me and my friend have got there, put our cameras over the railings and power them down and film, film trains to run and fly and board them. See, see us up there one day, it's us. Cool. So it's only just a, uh, and that's a car park, but it's, it's, a, it's a good spot if you want to film trains around the Morden. Because people are, are posted, because I took a picture of a train that even had the boat at Morden. People were like trying to, like I saw the comments and people were like, trying to work out how the angle, how the angle, how it was took and the angle and what time day it was. Let's go. Oh, Chris. Yeah. The busiest see it for ages. Yeah. I've got a backup camera.
trains northbound on both the city and Charing Cross branches. Currently, uh, we have a train at Highgate that's having some problems in the forward movement. Uh, as a result, the train's been held in platforms and may be diverted up the Edgware branch at short notice. I'll keep you informed as soon as I have any more information. Thank you. See you there. Not like a transfer train operator, but I'm not going to be
Thank you, sir. Yes. Nice. 